So Oli, you've signed a new contract which will keep you in Glasgow for another three years. How happy are you to be staying in Glasgow? Yeah, pretty happy. Um, I think it was a pretty easy decision from my part and took a bit of time negotiating with the club, but I'm glad that it's all sorted now and ready to put my best foot forward for the team. Uh, got a big three years ahead of me, so yeah, very happy. Is it good to get it all sorted so you can now just focus on the rugby? Yeah, I think so. I mean, you never really as a player want to be worrying about contracts and stuff that can sometimes affect your game. So for me, we've got security now, happy to do my best for the Warriors the next three seasons for sure. What, how much have you enjoyed the last couple of years in Glasgow? Yeah, first year was a bit tough for me, obviously, with injuries and stuff, but uh, really enjoyed last year, obviously, making the final at Celtic Park, which was a really special experience for myself. Um, but outside of the rugby, just enjoyed the boys, enjoyed the club, uh, really enjoyed like families and stuff around the club as well. I think uh, they've been really good with welcoming us, so yeah, we're really happy with that. Did making the final last season give you a taste of what you can achieve here at Glasgow Warriors? Yeah, I think so. I think we obviously a very aspirational club and uh, it's a big reason why I wanted to stay is be part of a sort of a league leading side. And uh, I think we've got all this, the right resources with that great coaching team, obviously a great group of players, a lot of them going to the World Cup now. Uh, and yeah, hoping to do the same this year, but maybe one step better. We also made the quarterfinals of the Champions Cup last season is is that something you'd want to go further in as well? Yeah I think we can I think we definitely have the ability to do so uh, it's just a question of maybe balancing on both fronts it's quite tough uh, sort of putting your best foot forward on both sides of the tournament but uh, yeah it's a def definitely a tough competition and it was great for me to be a part of it it was my f this time last year it was my uh, Heineken Cup debut and uh, Definitely a step up. I'd say it's very close to test match level, yeah. Got a new forwards coach in John DL. How much are you enjoying working with him? Oh, uh, yeah, I'd say, I um, don't know if Hums would be watching this, but I'd say he's a lot better than Hums. Um, but yeah, he's been good, really organised, uh, big on the detail, which I think is good for us as a forward pack. Uh, and I think we're making some good strides forward this pre season. And Petrus, of course, now doing a bit of coaching too and he's helping out with the scrum, is it must be good to have him there as well. Yeah, I think Parra is obviously a great man and offers a lot of energy around the club, uh, especially with us at scrum time, and he's very approachable as well. So for the young guys, they get to learn a lot from him. They're not scared to ask questions, and he's been a great mentor for all of us, I'd say. It's been a slightly different pre-season for you with so many players away on international duty. What's it been like here at Scottsdale over the last couple of months? Yeah, it's been different, I'd say. I mean, we've got a lot of young guys coming through now, a lot of academy boys. I'd say it's really good for them, good for us as well to mix in with them and pull them through. Uh, there's been a lot of sort of coaching from uh, the coaches as well, but it's been good. Uh, a lot of new faces, but it makes the older boys work hard as well, I think. I think first day of pre-season testing, some of the older boys got a shock with some fresh legs rocking up. Uh, so it's been good from that point of view, definitely pushing us every day. And the first test coming up, Ulster this weekend and then home the following weekend. Uh, are you looking forward to getting some game time? Yeah, I think everybody's looking forward to pre-season, for pre-season to finally be over and for us to actually uh, get some games in now. I think we're all really looking forward to it and it's going to be an interesting one. Obviously, we've got a lot of new guys, but uh, we also feel quite good about that and we've got a lot of good players in our squad at the moment. So it'll be great to obviously be back in front of the home crowd. The support's always good here and I'm pretty sure we'll get a good crowd for that game as well. What are you hoping to achieve in Glasgow over the next three years? Uh, keep my <laughs> keep my suntan. Uh, no, I'd, I'd say obviously what we want to do is win the league. Uh, perform better in Europe but first and foremost I mean I haven't won the league with this team yet so that's a big objective for me um, and yeah outside of that keep on pushing in Europe and see how far we go there as well.